Iron oxide powder is used in lots of experiments. At the end of this video, I'll show you a fun and quick experiment using it. I also leave a few links below. I bought this powder online and I assumed it was pure, but it has impurities that causes problems in my projects. To wash off the impurities, let's take a spoonful of the powder and mix it up with cold tap water. After mixing it and stirring it well, because we want to ensure that all the impurities get mixed up in the water. Let it sit for a few seconds. And after the powder has sunk to the bottom of the glass, as you can see, the water looks very muddy. This is what we want to get rid of. Now we want to give it some time so that all of iron oxide powder is sunk to the bottom of the cup. Now using any strong magnet, I'm using neodymium magnets here. We want to give it some time for the iron oxide to sink to the bottom of the cup. And it's held by the magnet while we are pouring out the water. And this is how we're going to get rid of the impurities. This process needs to be repeated several times. I did this about 20 times, so this is probably like 21st rinse that I have done. Let's mix it well and give it some time for the powder to sink to the bottom of the cup again. As you can see, it, the water it looks very transparent and that's exactly what we want. So uh, this, is the, this is the very last rinse that I'm going to do. And uh, after removing the water, I usually like to let the powder to air dry. After leaving it for several hours, it's all going to be dried up and ready to use. Now, before it, uh, it gets dried up, let's do a fun experiment with it. Uh, let's take uh, some of it and put it on, on a plexiglass or or anything similar as long as it's, it's uh, non-magnetic and have some fun with visualizing the magnetic lines. This is a very fun experiment. I'm trying to uh, have it at some angles so that you can see all the lines that get created. This is an inexpensive experiment compared to using ferrofluids. If you liked this, check out my channel for other magnetic experiments.